According to some sources, um, OpenAI wanted to release a high-income knowledge worker that is basically an AI agent that is designed to autonomously perform complex tasks, for instance, uh, financial analysis, PhD research, and so on. And instead of, like you as a company, instead of paying a human worker, you can now pay OpenAI 20K per month, but then getting much more out of it, right? Much more productivity. And um, yeah, I mean, it could be, say, if this one... A uh, high income knowledge worker replaces, say, 10 PhD level research scientists in your company, then, I mean, uh, it's cheap, cheaper to hire, like, to pay OpenAI 20k per month than to hire 10 PhD level researchers. And um, yeah, so it, it, it could be a good idea. And then now, it, very interestingly, uh, I mean, you could justify paying 20k for this, right? But now, we have uh, seen a new development and this is, this is a new development is Menus AI, uh, like this, the future of generative AI agent. You have probably heard of it and um, I have just checked it out and uh, you can already apply for access, it's possible. And now let's focus on one of the highest, uh, high, high, highest income value skills out there. It is often performed by financial analysis that have a PhD in say finance or data science, data analytics, and it has very high return on investment potential. And this is financial analysis. So uh, let's let it run uh, an, an analysis of Tesla stock. So give me a deep analysis of the Tesla stock. Now you can already see the Menos AI agent working. I am like, it does this completely autonomously. Here on the right, you can see what it does. Obviously it works really fast. So it, it first, it first, like it, here you could, you could quickly grasp the plan it is working on. So first it creates a checklist. It modifies the checklist at runtime and then it completes the task one by one. Check, 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 check. And in minutes it has completed hundreds of tasks. So it's much, much uh, faster than any human worker could be, right? And if, um, and obviously, if you let these kind of agents run on uh, on multiple tasks that run sub subsequently on each other, you could imagine that the actually research output is quite significant, right? Quite more, much more significant than say human level peer, uh, output. So let's look at some random graphics it generated during this work. Here you see intrinsic value of the company, initial revenue growth rate. You can see charts and stats and price per share of bull case high so it looks at uh, at like different investment analysis by other companies and uh here like um uh, like potential share prices in the future uh it like looks at all kind of data more data you could read in a month it probably reads in this one session uh, very quickly it shows the strength of having an ai agent over just a simple like chat gpt like interface where you can ask a question and it gives you the answer right because this agent now it actually performs multiple, maybe hundreds or thousands of prompts um, against a certain large language model with certain context windows. So there's no like restriction with the context of a context window. It can process large amounts of data by repeatedly prompting itself on subsets of the data and so on. And it can reason and do all those kind of things. And this is, this is like free, right? It will be, um, if I understood correctly, an open source, uh, like or at least partially open source so you can use it more or less for free okay so now now let's look at the impressive now it has given me it gives me this report i could read the report but what it also gives me it figures out okay there's a human asking for it and humans like dashboards so it provides me this dashboard now look at this dashboard it created for me it's like a tesla stock analysis dashboard it has created uniquely for myself right giving me like a, a stock price give me the 25 week range so I can see is the stock price still like where is it in the in the range it's currently over varied or, or, or higher range or lower range it gives me the executive summary Tesla maintains a dominant position in the EV market share it also has given me like the market share plots uh, I've seen um, as it generated the output uh, with significant technological advantages strong brand recognition expanding manufacturing capability the company has demonstrated a 42% CAGR compound annual growth rate over five years. So this is really first grade investment analysis, right? These are things I would, I would like to know where, before investing in a stock and achieved consistent profitability. They even give me discounted cash flow analysis. 
and uh, yeah, but it, but this analysis basically suggests that the stock is currently um, overvalued. So it gives me like grow investment rec recommendations. Three really beautifully done, right? Hold selective buy, value avoid. So it's currently a bit expensive. Income currently a bit expensive. Speculative could be a buy. And from ESG point of view, it could also be a buy because they try to save the environment, right? And here it gives me the financial performance, the revenue over the last couple of years. I can hover over the revenue number. So really beautiful dashboard, right? Interactive dashboard that gives me all information I would like to know as an investor. You can see net income is growing, revenue is growing nicely. Um, it gives me a valuation for different scenarios. It gives me the stock prices. Um, like the monthly stock prices it's not so recent it could be like a bit more recent maybe we could have uh, mitigated this by prompting it a bit better i'm not sure um maybe it's just a just a bit older analysis but um yeah i think it's i think it's really impressive to see what it can already uh, do right and you can already apply like i'm not I'm not uh, affiliated with Manus AI in, in any way, but you can already apply for this research agent. And I think today's Finkster productivity tip should be the following. Use these AIs because you can see like it's, ha it's like having 20K per month of value, getting it for free and being able to integrate this in, in your work, no matter what you are doing. It really doesn't matter if you are a teacher, if you are a professor, if you are a researcher, scientist, data analyst, a programmer. Uh, I mean, having something like this run 24-7, create value for yourself, for your own work, will actually like 10x your value proposition, 10x your productivity, and then 10x is even like lowballing it, right? And if you can increase your productivity by 10x by just using AI, uh, chances are you won't get disrupted, but you join the 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 legion of disruptors, right? The 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 people the people with AI, people using AI to disrupt other people that don't use AI. And so so using these AI agents will be the next thing. It will look like this. You just tell it analyze Tesla stock, and it will figure out use itself that you actually want to look at a dashboard. You don't even need to tell it that you want a dashboard. It just knows you would you you would um, you would like to be presented a dashboard, so you can grasp the information in a more visually appealing way. It gives me a SWOT analysis. It does all of this in seconds, right? And um, I mean, probably like just a year ago or two years ago, I would have to hire somebody for five hundred bucks maybe thousand bucks to create this dashboard for me, right? And so I, so by just using it, by just prompting it, asking it the question I'm interested in, like the Tesla valuation, uh, I would like get value that previously I had to pay a thousand bucks. Now I get it in, in a few seconds, right? So imagine I could somehow monetize this, maybe by finding better investment decisions, maybe by using it for my job, maybe using it for my startup, creating new startups, creating content, a blog or something, right? I mean, there are so many ways how you could, how you could use it. You could create your own YouTube channel. You can use it in so many different ways, something that previously cost a thousand bucks now you get in a few seconds now you simply need to monetize it maybe get extract only 10 percent or so of the value out of it uh, it is possible to monetize it or people wouldn't have paid a thousand bucks for it a year ago right or still paying a thousand bucks for it now or in a week from now right on upwork there will still be people paying a thousand bucks for, su for such an analysis to upwork freelancers so uh, because they just don't know tools like menus ai yet they don't know ai agents so, uh, so people still in a year, I'm confident people will, will pay. So, like there are some people who don't know the, about the capabilities of AI, so they will pay freelancers a few hundred bucks for such an anal analysis. When all the freelancers need to do is like um, giving the query, like uh, um, forwarding the query to an AI agent, getting the result, and in seconds, like uh, giving it to the client and, and earning some income, right? So there's so many ways to use this. Um, yeah, and in today's video, I just wanted to look at this quick analysis, stock analysis, and it's really like like as um, as ChatGPT here um, argues, um, the next wave of AI disruption will come from high-income knowledge worker 
uh, dis disruption basically. So uh, so they directly compete with 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 like high income knowledge worker that don't use AI. So it's uh, without an alternative. We we need to adapt or we will die economically speaking. Thanks for watching this video. I hope today's AI tip uh, was useful for, uh, to you. Um, the tip is to check out Manus AI, apply for Manus AI, use these AI agents on a daily basis, maybe create a habit tracker where you can check off whether you use it just to get into the habit of using these AI tools because AI agents will come quickly very quickly and they will hit hard if you are not one of those one of the people who um, who adopt this new technology and they are intelligent enough to replace 20k per month work knowledge workers so they directly compete with people that are currently getting paid 20k per month so uh, I mean it already should give us uh, uh, yeah something uh, some respect at least uh, yeah, if you like these videos, then please give me a like and subscribe to the channel. I will release um, weekly, daily to weekly AI tips. My goal is to help you improve your productivity by 1% every single day. So, so your productivity improvement will compound. Over a year or so, you could increase your productivity by 30 to 40x. But just using those tools by compounding your output um, with small daily um, actions. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.